hey guys again welcome in my channel which is tech to tour so in this video we are going to learn about vim editor 15 basic and most important commands let's know little about vim command vim is a free and open source screen based text editor command it is also support unix linux and mac based operating system so i have mentioned free uh, i have mentioned 15 commands on my ppt which i will execute in my operating system and as well i will teach you every uh, every command with every steps so before going to start uh, today's video i want to tell you about my channel i make as well videos on aws azure web hosting domain hosting linux docker kubernetes and etc so if you are so if you if you guys are willing to work on these technologies or you are already working on these technologies so you must subscribe my channel to get the new videos notification very first so let's begin this is my ubuntu operating system so i am logging okay and uh, this is my ubuntu system terminal and here i will run the ls command to view uh, the uh, directory and files so there is a file which is linux.txt i have created earlier and i will show you the st uh, the first command the our first command will be a vim vim and then file name so basically what does vim vim uh, we use vim for edit a file edit any file so let's i'm writing the vim command and the file name uh, first of all you have to write your vim and then after the file name okay so we we entered into the editor mode now our second command is i when we press i button then we go into the edit mode so let's suppose uh, i did not press i button so i can write anything here it will not work like it goes up and down left and side but it is not working it is not comes on editor mode so to edit the file I need to press the I button so when I press the I button it will show me on the bottom it is showing insert so now I am in edit mode so I can now I can write any word on the file so it will be print there okay so now we are go now we are going uh, our third command our third command is escape escape command uh, we use escape for get out from the edit mode so let's suppose we are uh, we are editing this file and now i have added now i have edited this file and now i want to get out from this uh, the editor mode so I need to press escape button so it will comes it will come out from the edit mode and here I will again type any word so it will not write because I have already get out from the edit mode so now we are uh, we are going in uh, fourth one command our fourth word command is shift plus G shift plus g will uh, does go to the bottom of file so let's suppose we are in we are in the same file and i when i will press the shift shift and g shift with g so it will go to the bottom of the file so you can see as well here it comes on the bottom okay and our sixth okay our fifth one command g, press g plus g g with g so it will 
go to the top of the file so so when when i <coughs> sorry so when i press g plus g so it will comes on the top of the file so uh, now i am in the top of uh, top of the line okay and our next command is dollar when you press the dollar button it will go to the end of the line so this command will uh, reach you at the end of the line so when i am pressing dollar okay so i am pressing dollar okay okay so okay so uh, before pressing the dollar we need to go in uh, we need to go and press the i button for the insert mode now okay i think it is not working just give me a moment okay sorry uh, actually there is some mistake in my command uh, first of all i will uh, correct my command it is shift shift plus g it is shift plus g when you press the shift plus g it will go to the end of the line right so let's come in the uh, linux terminal so just i make my cursor on the middle of the line okay so now i will press the shift plus dollar so it will comes on the end of the line as you can see and my next command is zero when i press the zero it will come into the first first on the line okay so i am pressing zero so it come on the first of the line right okay and my another command is my command number 8 here we need to get the number by the command shift colon se space nu means set the number set the number on the editor so let's do it so escape colon s e n u okay great so we got a numbers on our editor here you can see there are numbers uh, there are number reflecting on our ad, uh, on our file so it is our eight number command now i am going with command number 9 so it is similar but it will remove the number from the file so for this we need to run the command colon s e space n o n u means set no number so i will write the command here shift colon s e no n u okay so it has removed uh, the line number from the my file and now we are going to the command number 10 so this is most important command i use every day uh, to search any string so let's suppose we are in in the file and i want to search the word so let's suppose i want to search uh, the lpd so uh, i want to search the lpd word on my file so i will press the escape button and press the forward slash and i will write the l p d so it will automatically uh, reach me on the exact word which i am finding on the file okay so command number 12 uh sorry okay command number 11 is undo undo or redo 
सो लेट सपोज आई एम राइटिंग समथिंग ऑन माय फाइल एंड जस्ट आई वांट टू नाउ अंडो दिस ऑप्शन सो फॉर अंडो आई नीड टू क्लिक फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विल क्लिक ऑन आई विल प्रेस द एस्केप बटन टू गेट आउट फ्रॉम द एडिट मोड एंड देन आई विल क्लिक ऑन यू फॉर अंडो सो इट विल रिमूव माई एडिटेड फाइल विच आई हैव रिटर्न अर्लियर बट एक्सीडेंटली आई रिमूव इट एंड आई वॉन्ट टू गेट इट अगेन सो आई विल क्लिक कंट्रोल एंड आर फॉर रीडो सो विच कंटेंट आई हैव रिमूव एक्सीडेंटली इट कम्स अगेन राइट सो so that was the uh, redo option the command number 12 and now we are going to uh, in command number 13 which is colon q quit file without saving without saving the content okay so let's suppose i have written lots of uh, lots of content in my file and but i don't want to uh, i don't want to save this content and i want to uh, exit without saving uh, without saving a single word on my file so just i will press the escape button and will uh, enter the colon q and then enter so it will uh, it will giving my uh, it will giving me a error no write since last change add exclamation ka mark uh, to overwrite actually this is giving me error because i have edited and i have enter some content of words in my file but it, it is saying to me you have entered some files and without saving you are leaving from this file so that is why it is asking me to to if you want to go of uh, uh, if you want if if you don't want to save this file and want to exit from this file so you have to add the exclamation ka mark on this file okay so just i am adding exclamation ka mark with as again ex escape colon q and the exclamation ka mark and then enter so now we uh, we we have exited uh, exited from the file and i will check the uh, file content again uh, i will vim this command and will verify my content is saved there or not so it is not saved okay and my next command okay so my next uh, 14 number command is saying quit with saving file so now in this case i want to write something on my file and also i want to save and exit from the file okay so let's suppose i am coming on middle of my file and here i will press the i for the edit and i will write the content anything content randomly i will uh, select the words here and after that i want to save this file and get out from this files also so i will press the escape button colon and w for write means it will write the it will save the content and quit it will write the file and will quit also so when i press the enter so it will come from the file editing mode and again i will edit the file so my file uh, content is existing there okay and the fifth one option i have already told you like if you want to uh, some so something you want uh, something you want to edit in your file and want to quit forcefully without saving file so you can use this kind of option exclamation ka marks okay so i think uh, i have done for my today class and we will connect you again in next video so thank you
again i am telling to you if you want to learn linux azure aws docker kubernetes so subscribe my channel and like and comment thank you